The Unfollowed Dilemma, Why It Sparks Such Intense Emotions, written by Tonya Renee Anderson. Narrated by me, Charlotte. Welcome back to Spiritual Motivations, featuring original material by Tonya Renee Anderson. In this video, Tonya chose to dive deep into why people get so offended when they're unfollowed on social media. I mean, come on, it's not real life, right? Social media has become an integral part of our lives, shaping how we connect, communicate and express ourselves. It's a virtual playground where friendships, interests and even reputations are built and maintained. But what happens when someone decides to hit that unfollow button? Why does it sting so much? One key factor in understanding the offence taken when being unfollowed lies in the concept of the virtual ego. On social media, our profiles are curated representations of ourselves, carefully crafted to showcase the best aspects of our lives. When someone unfollows us, it can feel like a direct hit to this virtual ego, a rejection of the image we've meticulously built. This taps into a fundamental human need for validation and acceptance. The number of followers we have can become a symbolic measure of our social standing. Unfollows can make us question our worth and likability, even though we know deep down that our online persona is just a fraction of who we are. Another element contributing to the offence is the fear of missing out, or FOMO. Social media has a way of showcasing the best moments of others' lives, making it easy to feel left out when someone decides to exclude you from their virtual circle. This fear amplifies the emotional impact of an unfollow, creating a sense of exclusion and loneliness. Additionally, the constant stream of updates on social media can make us feel like we're part of a shared experience. When someone unfollows, it disrupts this perceived connection, triggering emotions similar to those experienced when left out of a real-life social gathering. Humans are social beings, and social media is designed to tap into this innate need for a connection and validation. The number of followers, likes and comments on our posts can serve as indicators of social approval. When someone unfollows, it's as if they're retracting that virtual stamp of approval, leading to feelings of rejection and self-doubt. In a world where metrics often define our online worth, an unfollow can be interpreted as a withdrawal of social validation. The subconscious question arises, am I not interesting enough? Am I not worthy of your attention? These questions can trigger a range of emotions, from sadness to frustration. One aspect that makes social media unique is the personalization of the virtual space. Unlike traditional media, our feeds are tailored to our interests, beliefs and connections. When someone unfollows, it's not just a statistical change, it's a personal one. It's a conscious decision to disengage from a curated stream that represents a part of our identity. This personalization fosters a sense of intimacy with our online presence. Unfollows can feel like a breach of that intimacy, leaving us wondering why someone would choose to distance themselves from our digital selves. In real life, we have limited control over how others perceive us and whether they choose to stay in our lives. Social media, however, gives us an illusion of control. We can choose what to share, how to present ourselves and even curate our audience. Unfollows shatter this illusion, reminding us that in the end, we can't control how others interact with our virtual personas. This loss of control can be disconcerting, especially in a world where autonomy over our personal narratives is highly valued it prompts us to question why someone would willingly distance themselves, leaving us to grapple with uncertainty and a perceived loss of agency. So there you have it. The complex web of emotions behind why people get so offended when they're unfollowed on social media. 
While it might not be real life in the tangible sense, the virtual world has become an integral part of our existence, intertwining with our emotions, self-esteem and social dynamics. It is crucial to remember that online interactions are nuanced and carry real emotional weight. The next time you find yourself on either side of the unfollow button, consider the psychological factors at play. And of course, don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel or I may become very offended. <laughs> Just kidding. Stay educated.